much should a guy earn for you to date him? Over 500k! Close to a million if he... What is up brothers and sisters? I hope you guys are all doing well. I heard Jesus was on his way back to earth. While we wait for Jesus, let's get into some women and their beautiful shenanigans. What's the craziest thing you did this year? Oh, had a threesome. What is the craziest thing you have done all year? I, I, I had a threesome. I, I was goggling three cocks at the same time. My booty got blasted. It didn't go bad, but I, it was with my best friend and her husband. And she got mad at me because he nutted at me and not her. Jesus Christ. That is crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> Sensational. What do you want? It's not that simple. What it's do you want? <laughs> I don't cook, I don't clean, but let yeah. me tell you, I got Aye. this ring. Mm, that's crazy. Cardi B's sweeping for her man. I don't need no man. I, look at how submissive Cardi B is being for her man. This is Melody Feliciano Johnson. She's seen here pouring bleach into her Air Force husband's coffee maker. Whoa. She seemingly really wants that life insurance money. The husband started noticing his coffee tasting strange, so he began to... No, she's poisoning his coffee. Oh, f Whatever's in there is a lot of it. It was pulled out. She's poisoning his... He would eventually hand over all of the evidence and Melody was arrested for attempted homicide. That's maybe like the worst thing that I've ever heard in my life. I understand that you maybe have resentment for your partner, but to try to kill him... <sighs> Once I heal and I start taking my medication consistently and I stop lying to my therapist and I actually start eating three meals a day and I actually hit the gym consistently and I stop going to sleep at... 4 a.m. and waking up at 2 p.m. and I actually start going to work instead of calling off and I actually decide to do something with my life and get a career and I actually go back to college it's over for you big yeah you guys better watch out that sounds like a person which has got everything under control he said good night honey sorry I haven't been on my phone much I love you so he's cheating on you so we're literally breaking up no, but I feel like he's literally in the middle of getting with the crowd right now. No, this is definitely the end. Like, this shit's hitting the fan right now. You have to block him. Yeah, I feel like this just isn't working out. Like, this just isn't healthy for me. I don't know what to do. A lot of guys are socially awkward. I think, I think you're a bit ignorant to, like, the average guy's experience. Consider this, right? The average guy today, his granddad had to put in a quarter of the work to mm -hmm. get the kind of woman that is four times as amazing as the woman he's attracted. Oh, you're, you're talking- Oh my god, that irritates her. She doesn't want logic, she just wants delusion. Hoflation. Yes, it's hoflation. Hoflation, so modern men have to work five times harder than their grandfathers did for women 20 times worse than what their grandmothers mm. were. It must be hard sitting in a room and people are just constantly calling you hoes and bitches. Every human being that you don't know on a personal level is not real. They're all NPCs and you can say whatever you want to them. Watch this. Hey, how's it going? Just here to drop off coupons. Perfect. Sweet. <laughs> Did you hear the big news? What's the news? Danny DeVito got an OnlyFans account. He did not. Yeah. 20, he so much money. $25 a month. I'll tell you right now, it is worth the money. Oh, that man is short and thick. Wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Have a good Monday night. <laughs> it's 11.30 in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Danny DeVito. Danny DeVito is one of my favorite actors of all time. <laughs> it's so random, he just appeared. Hey, Danny DeVito's got an OnlyFans. I'm like, God, that is so funny. <laughs> Some people don't really know how funny they are. My God. It's 11.30 in the morning. On a Thursday. <laughs> I, didn't give him, I didn't even give him coupons. Give him the instruction manual for my vacuum. Yeah, that's a good one. Sometimes you just gotta stir the pot. My sister, uh -huh. you were once afraid of sex. Uh -huh. but I wanna go to the boss. I gotta go to the boss. Look at you today. Mm. You are making money with it. Hey! <laughs> 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 I 
Africa has maybe, if not maybe like the funniest people. I like that about Africans. Africans, I'm an African as well. Why are you gay? This is what other people are not telling y'all. I dated these girls, he's dating these girls. Most of them are headaches. Yeah. Mm. You know what I mean? Like don't put all your eggs in one basket like, yo, I need a- Myron is the godfather of the red pill right now. He is he is running the game. I, I gotta give it to Myron. And the whole thing with them being demonetized, I think that that's super unfair, but that's how it is. When it comes to men's rights, guess what? Men get demonetized, they're not allowed to speak, but if we're talking about women, they can say whatever they want. Look at what Pearl said. I would ban plus size clothes. Huh. <laughs> so we just have a bunch of fat, fat people run around <laughs> naked? Yeah, yeah, no, that do. seems no, a little no, counterintuitive, no, they'd be Pearl. In the house. They'd be on the house on the tread. They can keep the clothes they have. But yeah, like, I, I can't like get rid of them. But from now on, we're not catering to you guys anymore. No plus size seats on planes. You just can't fly. Get on the treadmill, start running. Really bad, blah, blah, blah. Are y'all prepared for her to be an attention whore? Mm. Are you guys prepared for her to want to be around her friends all the time and do yeah. whole shit? Are you guys prepared for her to not clean up your place after you went to the gym for an hour or two and you come back and she's just on the phone looking at her Instagram? Are you guys prepared for her to be a narcissistic, annoying bimbo? Are y'all prepared for her to stop by every single mirror that she walks by to look at herself? Are y'all prepared for her to take three hours to get dressed? Just to come with some criticism, not all girls are like that. I would say 50-50. A lot of girls do get influenced by social media nowadays. And he is right when he says like a lot, like I've 50% of the girls which I've dated have been like that, but 50 has also been a little bit of a blend where they do a lot of social media, but then they don't. But then I've had maybe what, I would say maybe 10% of all the girls that I've dated, which have been just like these pure girls, nothing with social media, they want nothing to do with that. But those girls are rare. Are y'all prepared for her to, to, you know, introduce you to her social circle of friends who annoy the f*** out of you because they're useless as well? If you're dating a hot girl, you're gonna have those hot problems. Just like that song, hot girls, we have problems too. We're just like you, except we're hot. think about it, there's nothing to appreciate a man for. Oh my god, that's, that's just, that was just a violation. Stop, you don't have to hit them with the McDonald's and the cola. We get she's fat, she's a chubby fat chick, but you don't have to double punch her, you know? You don't have to go Mike Tyson style on her. How much should a guy earn for you to date him? Over 500K, close to a million if he... I'm not gonna say anything guys. I'm not gonna attack her. She's a beautiful princess, a queen, and she deserves the best. Does it? I'm not gonna say yes, do you hear me? How much should the guy pay for the engagement ring? The girl which is making this video knows exactly what she's doing. They'll pretend to be your friend, but they'll blast you out on the internet so you look like an idiot in front of everybody. Who needs to pay again? 500, he gets paid every year, 500, he saves that towards the ring. If he doesn't, he's gonna get a no and it's gonna be embarrassing. <laughs> You're welcome. Well, that was interesting. My name's Tyler and I'm a psychosexual. I'm only attracted to crazy girls. There's some- Hello, Tyler. There's something about mental instability that gets me absolutely bricked up. It's not easy, but I weed out all the rational girls on the first date. What would you do if I slightly deviated from an existing plan? I would say, hey, sometimes you gotta go with the flow. <sighs> Disgusting. Lose my number. It's tough being a psycho lover because women naturally conceal their insanity and then soft launch it after a few months once the relationship's more established. Little do they know <sighs> that insanity is actually what I want. What would you do if I came home, say, 20 minutes late? I would call you 12 times. What else would you do? I would go through your phone once you got home. Don't stop. I would get blackout drunk and get behind the wheel of my white Jeep Wrangler and if you really love me, you would make sure I wouldn't crash and die. Oh my god. I identify with that. I like it when they go crazy, like crazy possessive, you know, like they're, they just want to, you know, throw things and do all that. Not, not, a little bit violent, but you know, like for you. Oh my god. 
<sighs> All psychosexuals have a say. If she's fucked in the head, she can fuck in the bed. Ooh. Psychosexuals, we're here. And in this day and age, we're thriving. Besties, I'm literally leaving the club early because men are fucking. <sighs> okay, let's play with a thought, guys. You guys got a hundred million. Would you bang? Would you Would you tap it for a hundred million? I'm in the fucking drive-through of a Jack in a Box on my way home. <laughs> <laughs> And to go fucking eat my feelings. Like, what the fuck? Like, I'm literally a fucking 10. And this bastard doesn't see it. Don't take this the wrong way. You're, you're not a 10. I woke up like this and this is the way that I look. If a girl thinks that I'm ugly, then I'm ugly. If a girl thinks that I'm attractive, then I'm attractive. There's nothing more that I can do about it. Why not just be yourself? I think a lot of women would have better self-confidence if they just did not do all of that. What? No way. There's no way that that is the same person. It's night and day. Married life? Look at that. Pregnant life. Uh -huh. And she's pregnant? What? Yeah. I like videos like this. You gotta take care of her. You gotta take care of the ladies. Okay, guys, I have about 30 <laughs> seconds. Do not get married. Whatever you do, don't get married. It is not worth it. You have to do way too much work. Right, babe? That's what exactly a successful marriage uh, is taking care of your lady, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> What is that voice? Is that God? <laughs> oh shoot! Thanks for the hundred thousand dollars, dude. Ah! Uh, I gave away my whole life savings to you because I love you so much. What is it with guys and always sending money to women? Ah, oh, I don't understand that. Is that like seeding her? Is that the same thing as, you know, like creaming her? So much, mommy. Thank you for everything. I can't wait to be your king and run off with you for forever. Beat us! That's crazy, bro. I mean, uh, enjoy poverty. Babe, we got $100,000! Jesus! Ah, oh, she's got a boyfriend. She's got a... All right, y'all. Let's see what I got for you today. You know, today I just want to encourage you guys to follow <laughs> your dreams. You know, six months ago or so, I got broke off. Dude, I was hurt. And I decided to do everything that I tell you guys to do in these videos. And uh, I put my all into YouTube. And then I'm elated. I'm over the moon. I want you guys to feel these feelings. It's so amazing <coughs> to win. To actually set out on a dream and make that shit happen no matter what. There were some hardships, there were some difficulties, there were some ups and downs. But at the end of the day, my life is changing. Mm -hmm. I could see that I'm going to retire my mom. I could see the McLaren in my sight. You know, I could feel it. Everything's <coughs> going in the right direction. Because I've done all the stuff I tell you guys to do on these videos. And I really encourage you guys to pick a lane. Make it happen. I want you to feel happy. I want you to feel over the top. I want you to feel true elation in your veins. I want you guys to feel the happiness the joy, the excitement that I'm feeling these days. Oh man, today's video really got me. It was one of the funniest videos that I've ever reacted to. But anyway guys, like, comment, and share if you want to see more videos like this. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace!